Let me share with you how I get 1.3 billion an hour without boosts. Hey, on the Bolivians, it's Sister Craig. Hopefully, you're having a great day. I'm having a great day. We're back today in Pet Simulator X. And I am going to be sharing my tips and tricks on how to get some fantasy coins pretty quickly. Uh, because the current method I use for 15 pets nets me about 1.3 billion an hour. And that's without boosts. If I boost, we're looking at 4 billion an hour. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to break this down for 15 pets, 8 pets, and 4 pets. So y'all can see the strat I use, the enchants and basically how much you should be getting so and this will be on average and you'll see why once we get through the video intro stuff so if you haven't already please make sure you smash 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 the lovely like button and do the same thing with the subscribe button i would greatly appreciate it helps me out a lot and our beautiful pleb today is jen jen thank you so much for the love and support i greatly appreciate it i have used this technique since last update but everyone's like no you don't know what you're doing so the strat that i use in particular guys is we have four pets with charm so one two and this is for 15, 3, 4, so I have those 4. The rest of these are all fantasy coins, as you can see. Some of them have doubles, or like that one has super teamwork, that was just by chance. Uh, but most of these have royalty or fantasy coins 4 or 5. So this build is very, very expensive. Now, if you are just using 8 pets, you are only going to want to use 2 charm pets, and the rest fantasy coins. If you're using four pets, you're gonna to wanna to be using just one charm and the rest are gonna be fantasy coin four or five. Basically how this works is you always want someone working with you on the chest because since you don't have chest breaker and if you didn't know, this chest has 12 billion hit points. That's a lot, well 12 and a half. But you're like, sister, the other chest on Ancient Island only has one billion and people were breaking that in 30 seconds. If you didn't notice, no one's been making videos about destroying the haunted chest. Like, no one's no one's done that video. Because here's the deal. The pets that we were destroying with that were the dragons. They did 1.6. Most of the pets that people are running with are the Agnes. Though one of the, well, the ones that aren't heavily duped. But most of the pets people are running with are the Agnes or the Griffins. And, um just basic math here that's only a three times increase in damage that doesn't equal 12. so that's why you haven't been seeing a whole lot of people doing that is because I, this thing's a little bit beefier it's not as cool to say oh i got this done in you know 30 seconds by myself now it's kind of like eh. so i would recommend with this make sure you are working with someone else at the exact same time time okay i i have multiple people are allowed in the server and usually other people kind of trickle in and out as they want because they always know that me and zalan are both in here afking this chest so they can come in here and get some easy coins and break the chest so enough chit chatting because you always complain i do too much so i am gonna set a 10 minute timer on this chest i'm not gonna use any boost at all and we are gonna time for 10 minutes, me AFKing this lovely thing. I'll give y'all a really short time lapse. I'm gonna speed it up a lot, so I don't know if y'all be able to see anything. So, three, two, one, go. Alrighty. Our 10 minutes are up. Let me stop these guys collecting. 
So we started off with about 19 billion 456 million and we ended up with about 19 billion 658. So that's about 202 million in about 10 minutes. So simple math, you times that by 6, that equals 1.2 billion an hour. And that is without coin boost. Um, I also will say this is probably a little below average because part of what this deals with is charmed. We need charm to activate. When charm activates, I was getting 17, 18 million as a bonus whenever the chest exploded. So that's the big thing. And when you use the times three multiplier, that I've seen that go up to 60 million. Basically, whenever I would break the chest, it's 60 million automatically, which is a nuts amount. All right, I have two charmed because you're going to want to run with two charmed. And I'll just get rid of these two down here. Now, so this would be for someone who has eight pets. So we have everyone has fantasy coins except for my top one, which has charm. And this one has charm and super teamwork. So let's do it again. Alrighty, where are we at? Let me turn that off. Alright, let's move away. Alright, so we started off at 19,661 and we finished off at 19,759. So about 98 million in total for the 10 minutes. So I'm going to round that up to 100 to make numbers nice and easy. So that's about 600 million. 600 million without boosts in an hour. Okay, so that is with eight lovely pets. We have one more time. We're going to do this with now four. So because unfortunately uh, my lowest pet also has teamwork, I'm actually going to take that one off. I'll take a lot of these off because most people won't have the higher end ones. So I'm going to take that guy off and that does leave us with four. So let's go do this one more time. Alrighty, I'm gonna go and let that chest break. So, we started off with 19,759,000,000. We ended up with 19,795,000. So, that was about 36 for the 10 minutes. So, per hour, that is about 200 and... I'd say 20. 220, I rounded up a little bit. Just a little bit. So that's kind of how that works and the rates that you should be getting this stuff at. Uh, 
Understand that the more people you have on the chest, the higher chance you're going to get bonuses more frequently. Just because the chest is going to be breaking a lot faster. Um, I did note during the original test, uh, Zalan did disconnect for a little bit, so probably could have gotten better. And of course, if you have more people, rates will be higher because we're looking for bonuses. Bonuses is the key to this build, and the more bonuses you get, the more you can get. Every way I showed you, if you use triple boost, you can at least get half a billion an hour. Uh, that's just with four pets. The more pets you have, the more you can get. So, plebs, thank you for making it to this part of the video. Hopefully this was informative. Hopefully this helps y'all grind out some coins before the next update so y'all can be very, very prepared or help you finish off any of your teams. My only issue with this build is it is expensive to enchant. So I'm just now, just now getting some diamonds back. So, uh, that's kind of the only hiccup with this build. But, thank you for making it to this part of the video. My individual video crew, y'all are awesome as always, and I will see y'all next time. Bye! Before we go, guys, I want to give a big shout out to my lovely knights of the YouTube channel. I greatly appreciate all y'all's support. Y'all are amazing. And a big shout out to my emerald knights. Thank you so much for the love and support. See y'all next time.